Peace, y'all. My name is Dane Barrett. I'm an African artist, educator, and scholar from New Orleans, Louisiana. And with your support, I'd like to launch my clothing line, Happy Cat. Happy Cat will be a Pan-African, Afrofuturist inspired clothing line whose motto is Stay Woke. Its mission is to wake people up to the world around them, wake people up to their potential to change that world, and inspire them to pass that fire on to their community. My goal as a designer is to create clothing that serves as armor for culture workers and culture warriors that provides a compass for people searching for their roots and sends out positive vibes to all, especially those struggling to make some kind of positive change occur. I wanna create things that celebrate the powerful, mesmerizing nature of black culture and also show respect and dignity to the wearer and support them in whatever effort they might pursue. My joints is gonna, my joints are gonna be like Air Jordans for the soul, except I got a lot more love for you than Nike. You know what I mean? The symbols that you see in my design are from a language I'm creating called Gola. I'm creating Gola in response to the ways that all the violence which affected African people throughout the slave trade, the colonization of Africa, and our subsequent miseducation outside and inside the continent has prevented many of us from knowing where our ancestors are from and connecting with our heritage. In that sense, Gola is an answer to the question, where could I be from in Africa? And its response is right here because Africa is wherever Africans go. I've decided to create Gola to represent the experiences, stories, philosophy, and style of African descended people in Louisiana. For me, it's important because not only is it an act of defiance and refusing to accept that the violence will prevent me from knowing where I'm from, it's also an act of healing and recognizing that in spite of the tragedy from which my people come, we can turn that into an opportunity to see ourselves as a new African people and create a new African culture. And my first step in that is to make a language. Your contributions to this project are crucial. With your help, I'll be able to start up my business online and begin producing some of the designs I have on clothing. It's t-shirts, hats, and sweatshirts for the winter. I'm also a working artist, and this fall I'll be pursuing my graduate degree in education. So I definitely need to get this business up, running, and working so that I can use it to put myself through school and also support my efforts in developing Gola as a language. Gola is a language of storytellers. Each symbol stands in for a different concept, idea, or proverb. So for instance, in this t-shirt that I'm wearing, which is one of the gifts you could receive for contributing to my campaign, the symbols in this design tell a story about cats like you and me. It starts with this one, Happy Cat. Happy Cat is you waking up in the morning, becoming aware of the world around you, becoming aware of your potential to change that world and of the skills you may have in pursuing that goal. This second symbol is called Griot. A Griot is a teacher, someone you meet that helps you to develop yourself and your skills in pursuit of creating some kind of change. This final symbol is Huru. Huru is you in the form of a culture warrior. That's you going out into your community 
spreading your light and using whatever skills you have to uplift the people around you. So one of Happy Cat's major influences is Afrofuturism. Afrofuturism is a recent cultural movement that takes the experiences of black people from the past to the present uses science fiction, fantasy, imagination, and political awareness, and reimagines all of those experiences in a futuristic setting. And Afrofuturism asks the question, what will the future be like for black people? What will black people be doing in the future? And Afrofuturism also argues that the experiences of violence, forced removal, alienation, creativity and beauty that black people experience throughout the globe is the stuff of science fiction. My intent in creating Happy Cat is to propose a new culture and a new future for African peoples, especially those who are outside of the continent and have been isolated from it. My goal as an artist and a teacher is to use something, is to create something inspired by my own heritage and transform that into a teaching tool. Eventually when I have GOLA completed, it'll be a language that's meant to be put onto walls and it will turn whatever space that the symbols are painted onto into a classroom. Finally, just in closing, um, no matter what you can contribute to my campaign, please, However you can, spread the word about the work I'm doing. Tell people about Happy Cat and the Gola Language Project. Tell them on Facebook and tell people in person. Use all your social networks to get the word out about my campaign. And when you talk to people about it, I want you to ask them, what do you think the world will be like if African people, especially those outside of the continent and the diaspora, the people who have lost their languages and almost lost their history decided to create their own language and start a new history. Most of all, thank you for listening and thank you for your support. Peace.